Welcome to today's lesson. It's for the Gypsy Jazz ukulele and it's all about diagonal arpeggios. Let's get started. All right, so here is the diagonal arpeggio method for the ukulele, starting on the root of G. They're all gonna have this open G string, so we're gonna start with G major six. There's a G major six chord. We've got the one, three, five, six. One, three, next octave, five, six. And be sure to practice a descending. And be sure to strike the chord so you hear the flavor of it. You go a little bit faster if you want to. Descending. G minor six. We use this one quite a bit in gypsy jazz. That's just me showing off there. Let's do it slowly. One flat three, five, six. One flat three, five, six. And descending. Seventh chords, G major seven. One, three, five, seven. And that's major seven. One, three, five, seven. Notice how this first finger is kind of guiding with the root, fifth, root, fifth. You'll often see me kind of plant my finger there ahead of time so that I know I will be accurate. One, three, five, seven. One, seven and descending for the major seven okay and g major seven g dominant seven very bluesy one three five flat seven okay one three five flat seven okay and descending later on i'll show you some cool licks shape. Now we have G minor 7. Okay. G minor 7 chord. G minor 7 arpeggio. 1 flat 3, 5, flat 7. 1 flat 3, 5, flat 7. Again, really know those formulas. Descending. G minor 7. G minor 7 flat 5. This can also be called a half diminished chord. 1 flat 3, flat 5, flat 7. 1 flat 3, flat 5, flat 7. And let's descend. And here's a chord. And finally, G diminished 7. The star of the show, the best for last. trick but here it is slowly one flat three flat five double flat seven or we can call it a six one flat three flat five double flat seven again or six i'll do that without talking decent here's a chord here's a chord here's a chord there's only one diminished seven shape on the ukulele. <laughs> so make sure you learn this chord shape, whether it's here, 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 or here. Same four notes, it just inverts itself. And we use that quite a bit in gypsy jazz. All right, congratulations. You just learned the diagonal method of arpeggios on the ukulele for your sixth and your seventh chords arpeggiated. Now, of course, you have to apply them to some songs and have some fun. We'll see y'all next time.